Hi, today we're shooting another off-season film. We're going to stroll through Antibes in December uh, to shoot a few more impressions for, uh, for our travel guide. And uh, yeah, we hope you enjoy what we're going to show you. Anya? By the way, in our second part of the film, we are going to share a story with you a friend has told us. It's about a British Secret Service officer who has infiltrated into France via Antibes and he was on a special mission.
Hope you enjoyed our impressions of Antibes and its old town. We'll tell you more about the city another time, we promise. Now stay tuned if you want to learn more about the Secret Service mission we mentioned at the beginning of this film. Can you imagine a submarine surfacing right here in this beautiful bay? Almost exactly 80 years ago, in the middle of the Second World War, that's precisely what happened in the pitch black night. The British submarine Unbroken landed in the Baie de la Salise on April 21, 1942. In a rowboat, the British Secret Service agent Peter Churchill came ashore right here at the Pointe de Lillette, not far from the rampart walls, at around 3 in the morning. No doubt it was a highly risky operation. There was always the danger of being discovered. The war memorial later was installed where Churchill set foot on French soil at that time. And his mission? Churchill was to deliver two radio sets and two radio operators to the home of the doctor Elie Lévy, a kingpin of Antibes' résistance or resistance movement, who lived three blocks up on Avenue Foch. In his book, Duel of Wits, Peter Churchill later writes about his four secret missions into wartime France between July 1941 and April 1943. The memorial also commemorates local hero Elie Lévy. A year after the submarine landing, he was arrested in Antibes and deported to Auschwitz. He never came back. <laughs> 